Dr. James Emmanuel Kwejie Agre, mostly known as Agre of Africa, is regarded as one of the leading figures of the history of education in Africa. He was considered a great sociologist, orator, preacher, and far-sighted politician. He advocated for interracial cooperation and helped to cut the path of progress for the African race in many fields, particularly in the direction of religion, education, and agriculture. What are some interesting facts about Dr. Agri? Dr. Agri hailed from Anumabu, the central region of the Gold Coast, which is now modern-day Ghana. He was born on Monday 18th, October 1875. His father was the chief linguist for the king of Anumabu, and his mother was the daughter of a great medicine man. He was the 17th child of his father and the 4th child of his mother. He started attending the Wesleyan school just before his 8th birthday and was often seen walking with his eyes glued to a book in a steady pursuit of knowledge. After completing instructional training, Dr. Agri became a temporary teacher at the tender age of 14 and was responsible for a class of 30 boys in a school in Abura Dungu. Dr. Agri was noted for his leadership abilities from an early age. At the age of 15, he was already in control of the school at Abura Dungu, serving as kindergarten teacher, primary teacher, headmaster and all. He became the headmaster at the Wesleyan Centenary Memorial School at the age of 23. In 1898, Dr. Agri moved to the United States to study at Livingston College in Salisbury, North Carolina. There, he took courses in politics, economics, and chemistry. Besides English, he spoke four languages including French, German, Greek and Latin. Between 1920 and 1924, Dr. Agri researched on and spoke in several African countries on the best ways to improve education on the continent. The often used quote, when you educate a man, you educate an individual, or when you educate a woman, you educate a family, is from his lecture in Ghana, where he advocated for the education of girls, and for Achimota College, where he taught to be co-educational. Dr. Agri was married to Rosebud Douglas of Port Moody in the United States, and together they had four children. Their youngest son, Orison Rudolph Agri, served as a United States ambassador to Senegal, Gambia, and Romania. November 2004, the city of Salisbury, North Carolina, and the state of North Carolina honored Dr. Agri and Mrs. Rose Agri with a historical marker at the Salisbury, North Carolina home in recognition for their contributions to the city of Salisbury and the state of North Carolina.